beautiful, beautiful day. It is so nice out right now. The rain is gone. Happy Thursday. We are back. Uh, we're going to end up. Okay, welcome back. Welcome back. We lost power there. Uh-oh. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't do that. There you go. All right, so we've already broken down a lawnmower, three AC units, um, and yeah, a lawnmower, a couple AC units. This is all the buildup. We've just been kind of stacking stuff, just getting through the bigs. What's he doing? Oh, he got out and moved it. Uh, just kind of getting through some of the big stuff. So now we are... I think we're gonna bust down some fans. I need to get some of the clutter out of here right now. So we're gonna go one fan at a time. We still got a bunch. Look, I just started copping out, cutting out the copper and throwing it over to the side. Just trying to get the big units out of here, you know? All right, well, I'll bring you in on everything that we do. I guess first we'll go after this. We'll take this apart and see how hard it is to get in after this. And then, uh, We'll bring you back and show you what it looks like. Look, I got gloves on. Yang, yang, yang. Our first devastation of the day. I threw a, one of those motors in there and it didn't work. It busted it. Ah, so I've just been waiting to get this. So we got this cleared out and we'll get another one in there. That's why we pick up so many though. Because they're going to bust. They're going to break. There's our little pump. So that'll go in as number one prepared. And motors, boom. Uh, we're gonna do next, let's just start getting into fans. So we'll bring you back out every couple fans or something. The breakdown. Stay like that. Hey, how you all doing? We're gonna take apart this, uh, this fan. Might as well have you guys watch me. See if I've got any quicker. We're taking these fans apart. Holy moly, I have my little magnet. Just in case. Just in case. I feel like. I feel like something. Um, I feel like we're going at a pretty good pace. But goodness, not quick enough. This is the last fan. So that's good. I think this is the last fan. Then we can get to. Uh, to break down some of this other stuff. We can move on, as they say. You make me feel like dancing. I got a little sniffles going on. Come on. Trying to get as much out of these things as physically possible. I already noticed we do not have that grass yield so far that we've had the past couple weeks. So hopefully, Right into that thing. Got it. Take this whole thing. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Lucky they didn't have a fire. Fire, fire. You could have had a fire. And I'm glad you did it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only you could prevent forest fires, kids. Grab it up. Smokey the bear. Boom. We'll have a leaf right out of there. Do you guys ever say any crazy words? I feel like I'm always saying crazy words. Like, shlabble about them. Oh, yeah. Oh, we out here. Three minutes. Oh, look at this. I'm over on the side there. Oh, oh. One more. Oh, I'm here with Olivia in the background. Mm -hmm. ah! Our tin bucket is almost filled up. These things here are aluminum. Sometimes you can get them off. Sometimes you can. I got that little set pin right there. Not my nose. I pretty much ruined this whole thing now. Come on. Uh, you think I can ruin another one? Not bad yet. That other one's getting too big. It's always the little things. All right, not worth it. Five minutes. Clean one of these down. Bring you over here. This is the whole thing that we got now. That whole bin is filled. We got that on the uh, clean aluminum. That's what we got for a little bit of brass, and that's just junk. All right, what else are we doing? This is clean aluminum. We can go in a little pile here. All right, we gotta go around and just keep knocking stuff out. I'm gonna do this brass light next. So let's go. All right, we are 
We are back on the head cam for this one. See if we can't get all this out. Boom, some over here, some over there. Yes. 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 We have the wire situation right now. Cray cray. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Let's nip this thing here. All this here is all stick to the icky. Stick to the icky icky. This isn't. That isn't. That isn't. That isn't. Any clean brass we can get, we will take. I really gotta pass that through a machine. I'm gonna hit it. Like this stuff. Brass. Take it apart. Take it apart. Our magnet is our best friend in this kind of situation. Oh, I hear a little dirt bike action going on in the neighborhood. Yes. Give us it all. Give me all of that clean brass. All right. Now, the next part. Go like that. What is this thing? Why are you still over here? Webby! My drill. What I don't want to do, I'm going to have to do it in a different trash can. I don't want to break that glass. So it just goes nuts in here. <sighs> All right, what do we got going on here? Oh, look at that. That thing came out as a whole piece. Like that. Yeah. Come apart, baby. Come apart. That aluminum. Is this whole thing aluminum? I'm sure, there are some happy people to see me working with some gloves. Jubilation is going on. Like, look at that man with gloves. Holy moly. It's a regular Christmas Day miracle. Yeah. Look at those go. Yeah! <sighs> Don't 
But do you see what I mean? I'm definitely right now a lot more reckless than I would be if I didn't have gloves on. I would be so much more careful than what I'm being right now. I am being danger, danger, danger. And why? Because I have a false illusion that these gloves are just gonna keep me safe over everything. Sharp glass, drill bits, my whole face. It's just gonna protect me. Now whether it actually does or not, different story. But at least I have the illusion like I'm protected. And I don't have any cuts yet, so that's good. I mean, I guess it's better than having a cut. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. There we go. Ooh, thought I felt some blood. Blood has a very distinct feeling when it's running down your arms, body, leg, anywhere. All right, look at us go. I love it. And if you see me look away, because I'm not looking to get my, hold on. Hey, Any glass in my eyeballs. I know what you're saying. Then you should be wearing glasses if you're not looking to get glass in your eyeball. That just makes too much sense. You know, if you've been watching this channel for a while, you know that we don't make that much sense. I mean, it's the little things. Gotta be happy that we're wearing gloves. Acting reckless. Get that out. And I'm sorry, but that bridge was about the wildest thing I've ever seen in my life. For people who don't have, uh, for people who have here fear, fearfulness of bridges, don't ever watch that video because, oh my goodness, that was some crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Crazy stuff. All right. Look at that, that thing is all busted down. And I'm pretty sure that is aluminum. Uh, what am I gonna scratch this with? Scratch test, scratch test. No, I don't know. I think the stuff holding it together was maybe aluminum. I'm putting it in here. That's what I'm doing. I'm sure our buddy Jeffy will hit us off at the pass if it isn't.
All right, now to take apart this light. Come on. Look at it all. Are you on threading? Seems like it is. All thread. Ooh, that's got some weight to it. Aluminum. Aluminum. -um. Our aluminum bucket isn't as big as it. Other weeks. All right. Bring that in there. Oh my goodness. Get into all of these things, get those wire nuts off, get the clipping, clipping and stripping. Uh -huh. Definitely prayers for the whole Baltimore area, all the people who are affected by that, the maintenance workers who are on it. Any of the cars, I heard there was police there stopping people from getting on before it happened. But, I mean, that just whole thing is just so crazy. Not even a word for that. Not even a word for that type of crazy. things out of here come on lights it's burger night we got started around I don't know 2 2 30 something like that Um, yeah, so I don't know if we'll be able to get this all broken down tonight. I wanted to strip wire. I wanted to do a bunch of stuff. So if we have to, we can set out like two to three hours in the morning. But I have to be in on the morning run. We have to, have to, have to be in on the morning run. There is no other choice well there is another choice but what am i doing let's break out some tools do you got some tools i think i do would you like to use them there we go there we go we're having burgers for dinner i don't know if i mentioned that already nice Nice burger. That's gonna be coming up anytime. Lauren's gonna come out and be like, hey, I got your burger. And I'm gonna be like, you're the best, honey. She's gonna be like, yeah. You better remember that. And I say, I always remember that. You're so good to me. Do 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 bow. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Let the good times roll. Come on, come on, baby. What a sniffling. I don't want to gross you guys out, but as soon as you guys leave, snot rocket time. We're going to deal with this nonsense. Look at this big old piece, big old honking piece. 
Yep. That goes in there. Oh, look at that. That's the first piece that's been a non sticky sticky. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That piece just comes right out. We pull all this out like there was no doubt. Boom. All right. I'm going to do that for the rest of them. You guys see it. Wire there. Over there. We will be back. I think from the other day. Boom. Get that all broken up. Good to go. We are still just poking through. Poking through. I wanted to bring you guys in on that. On the big uh, smash. That's how we got the faucet off. Big smash and grab there. So let's go bring that over to the side. It'll be all dirty, dirty, dirty brass. Maybe some clean brass and some dirty brass all together as a team. Team brass. I tell you, they tightened my hubs the other day. Yeah, they tightened them right up. I was so happy because they were loose as a goose. <laughs> loose as a goose, I say, away. Up next, this bad boy. Give us some cords. Uh, we broke that thing all down, that faucet. Broken down to the ground, come on. Well, we uh, we took the sawzall to it. I figured that was just a easier way. I couldn't go inside and eat my, my Krabby Patty. Eat my burger. Come on. All right, well, I couldn't go inside and eat my burger without finishing that thing. So we're gonna go eat, and then we're gonna come back, and we are gonna go live, live in effect. We will do that when we come back. <sighs> Do a little live action. I don't even know what this is. Is there some? Oh yeah, there's some wire in there. There's some wire in there. Put that right there with the wire power. Look at all the water. Look at all the moisture. Dude, we have so many wires to go through. You're like, how many wires do we have to go through? So many. So, so many. Let me see if we have something for this. Who knows what we have anymore? You make me feel like dancing. That is not a fit. That is not the fit that we are looking for. That isn't either. I feel like I've been dealing with this all day of Things not fitting like they're supposed to. You know? I feel like that's something that has been going on. Come on. Get this last little piece out. Pop the top again. Mmm. Oh, you don't, you don't want to play, huh? You don't want to play. All right, I don't want to play either. So, you can go over there. All right, well, let's go eat. And then we will be back to play more games with you people. Still seems like we're a long way away. All right, we are back and Team Mighty Mouse won the coin toss. We went live. Clarity 
picked uh, Bonita Sinclair, I believe it was. And she picked Tails. Tails never fails. And boom. Tails it be. Winner, winner. Chicken dinner. Now, uh, Mighty Mouse will have the last load of the month. Could it make the difference? Could it make all the difference in the final standings? Are we that close? I honestly do not know. I'm gonna do the numbers tonight when I get all done here and see how close we really are. I honestly have no idea. If I have to say though, if I have to say, I think Mighty Mouse needed it. I'm just gonna go there and say, I think Mighty Mouse needed the last load Scrapzilla has had a big week this week. Three runs for Scrapzilla this week. Just full boss mode. So I think, and this is just me thinking, thinking out loud. Um, I think that's gonna be it. I think it's gonna need it. So, but it could, it could push it right up in there. All right. We got to break apart this one before it gets dark. And then I think all the big stuff is broken down. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, we pulled out that engine, I mean motor as well. And we pulled the brass off of it. I think I did that while we were live, so. So far, a nice little stack. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put Scrapzilla away here soon. And then hook up to Mighty Mouse. And start filling her. But there is still so much to be done. We are gonna work till about 8 30 tonight we'll break out the lights and then we'll jump in here early tomorrow early early tomorrow and uh start breaking it all down not breaking it all down but we got to do some wire yeah we just have a bunch to do i wonder if he'll let this go in as extrusionary your extrusionary devices. Minus seven in Canada. Minus seven. Goodness, we were talking a big country. Big country scrapper. If you ain't, if you don't know about him, go over and check that man out. My man said he got 30 ACs today. 30, three zero, 30. That's good number. That's a good number right there. All right, we're gonna keep breaking this thing apart. Just keep itching away at it. So we will bring you back in a little bit. This is the thing looks clean, don't it? Goodness, it looks clean. Does not work. I know that to be factual, but it does look clean. So we'll see you guys later. All right, it is 8.30. And I think we are going to call it for the night. Um, pretty much leave everything out where it is. We got the table all cleared off. We'll come out first thing in the morning and start jamming out some wire. Get all that in. Then we got to get all of our copper done. Then once everybody starts waking up, we'll cut all the ends off of this. And then hopefully there's still a little time for us tomorrow to get in some beer break. That is the plan anyway. Look at that thing. Oh, how horrific. Oh, just burn all those buckets, I guess. Look at, he can't get in anywhere. He's like, I want to get in there. I can't get in there. Oh, I'm not even showing you. I'm sorry. Yeah, there's a big old nasty spider in there. Hello, spider. Yeah, look at him. Now he sees that I'm there. See him right down in there? I don't want no part. All right, so once again, we got wire, we got copper, we got a bunch of stuff to do in the morning. Um,. Let me bring you over here. We're going to have to do all that. All that is ready to load. We already got Mighty Mouse started to load. It's a good first step. Is that brass? 
there's such thing as brass reefer coil sure and heck don't look aluminum all right well tomorrow's another day we're gonna get out first thing in the morning bright and early and just start beating this stuff up whole bunch of copper to recover tomorrow a whole bunch of wire to get through and we're gonna get in before lunch so as soon as we wake up tomorrow get out here and get jamming so i'll see you then good morning we are here that thing looks brass don't it doesn't that look like a brass radiator core not radiator core but reefer core all right good morning we have to button all this stuff up i was thinking about it and i think we're just gonna go straight straight into just putting all this wire up i'm not gonna pull the tabs off I'd rather take my time today and strip more wire before pulling all these tabs off. What do you got here? You magnetic? Nope. All right, well, oh, that was part of my thing. I threw it in there. Anyway, we are going to hop right to it, get at it, and start pulling these things apart so <sighs> we got a lot to do today a lot to do first thing i'm going to dive into is getting all these wires up i think that'll be first then we will be back all right a little midway update uh we just have to load those up we got to cut the ends off of those those are already done all that copper is broke up all the wire is broke up we are getting close to end close to the end and then we're going to start stripping wire for the remainder of our time. So I think we're still looking pretty good on time. I haven't checked it. I think it's like 8.30, 8.45, something like that. We want to be uh, finishing up by 10, out of here by 10.30, the latest, the latest. So let's keep on keeping on, moving on. I'm going to start cutting all these up now. All right, we are back. We got this thing filled up. We are just gonna strip wire until we have to leave. Boom, boom, boom. So she is filled up, ready to go. We got 10 dirty brass, clean brass motors. There is a uh, clean aluminum over there. Condensers, compressors, whatever we call these things. What are these things called? A compressor? I always forget. Anyway, got a bunch of them, some cut ends. Uh, more reefer core The last load of the month number two copper And we're gonna do some number one right now, so I'm gonna do that until we have to leave Well, we've had our first accident with the machine My finger went right up in there and it cut it oh, like Right there down to like right there I'm not really sure how deep it is so we let it bleed for a few minutes and then I just you know did what i do put a band-aid on it and let's get back to work we don't have too much longer so we're going to keep right on it stripping wire that's where we're at so far Woo, let's go all right so we came over to jill's side first um yeah actually i went to jeffy first but he wasn't there and i don't have a lot of time so I'm trying to be as quick in and as quick out as possible I am going to leave you guys with me because you're going to be my little timekeeper. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Just move all this stuff right back here. It's all going to Jeff anyway. Boy, I'm not making things quick.
Don't you hit that truck. Don't you do it. Twisted metal. Yeah. on being quick. He's uh, on. It's not bit me. Jeffy, go see him. There he is, right there. And off we go, off we go, off we go. I'm ready to come to you. I'm ready to come to you. What's Happy up, buddy? Friday. Happy Friday. How much is it worth? How much is it worth? Not enough. Not enough. Not it's enough. never enough. That, that's my answer for everything. All right, I'm coming up to you right now. Thank you for the warning. Yeah. Yeah. I love you. Love you too. All right, we'll, buddy. We'll see you soon. Can I surf on the back of this thing? Yeah. Like back home? Go ahead. You gotta hit it. You gotta hit it. <laughs> Let's go. There you go. Oh, nice. There you go. Are those brass or is that me? Is that crazy? Is that crazy talk? Are those brass or is that crazy talk? That's not brass. That's aluminum. Yeah. It's just a anodized. It's just a what? Anodized. Gotcha. I was gonna say, I ain't never seen that before. If that, if that was brass, it'd be a lot heavier. Yeah. Oh, I got way more of this too. You want all this over there? Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> there's more. But wait, there's more. <sighs> How you doing? You having a good day? Huh? For the weekend. Yeah, right. I hate coming in here this late. Why? Because I feel like I, I don't want you guys to no, have to stay any later. Get paid by the hour, not the customer. <sighs> yeah, but then Karen up there has. I don't know. I don't want to come back to get money. But that guy there, he should have like, he should have backed out. Yeah, he should have backed out. I left him a spot to back out. Yeah, and then, uh, like, he's sitting there right by the dumpster with the crane. Right, and he's trying to work. This is all the stuff that I was working on. Oh, I forgot this. Hold on, last piece. 
310. A lot of work cleaning all this crap. What are we doing next, buddy? This is all clean. Go in there. This is all clean. There. What's next, dirty? This is dirty. No, you don't want to look at that. Uh, yeah. And then motors, clean aluminum. I got two yeah. motors here. I get the wire, right? You get that wire. Yeah, they get that wire. They get that wire. And there's some bear under there. I don't want to hear it. I know. Sorry, buddy. Hey, this is a family program. Are uh, the motors cleared? I said as long as I could keep production up, and we did 13,000 pounds this week with scrap, with breaking everything down, so it's tiring. Oh, Ooh. One more. Oh, hand in the face, hand in the face. Oh. Look at him, look at him. Easy on my trailer. Easy on the trailer, huh? Don't hurt her. Yeah, I, <laughs> you all right? I, 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 I know, I know. Oh my goodness. Clean, clean machine. Good? Well, this is probably, no, nah, it's got that on it. Just do that, it's clean. Yeah. Yeah, just dump the whole thing. What is that, Mikey? I know. I meant to. You're supposed to not come back with anything. I know. So hook me up. Hook me up, number one prepared. Let me wear it out. I can't Look, do that. I got some extrusion yeah. right there. I, I can't do that. You lie. I don't have that in there. You, you do. I'll show you. You you tried this with me before. I have tin. You've tried this with me the whole, I don't have it in the computer. Nonsense. Nonsense. That's all right, you wanna put it in this tin? Come help me lift this thing, you beast. You all cleared up? Ready? Freaking thing! Ready? I dumped this thing twice this month. That's a record. Really? Yeah. You all right? Yeah. Yeah. Let's pass it back here. Jesus! <laughs> Who packed this thing? Look at all that good stuff. Look at the wire. Oh, oh, oh. Stay on the scale.
Oh, I got more light. Holy crap. Yeah, what do you want to do? Light? What am I hooked on to here? Thank you, bro. Kev, thank you, man. I appreciate the help. I'm gonna help you. I know. We're not trying to fade your shine here, buddy. Oh. A lot yeah, like work. Uh, next door. Uh, yeah, I started using them. Are you this? Uh, sh no, that's just going in. The stuff all below it, I already stripped. I only do like eight and up. You ready, Freddy? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Just time-wise, you know what I mean? What's that? Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh stripping. Yeah, stripping the... <laughs> to do it all? Oh, that's dope. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Seven bucks a pound. What? Copper? Yeah. The uh, people who melt it down and make and stuff out of it. Yeah. Say bye, world. Bye, world. All right, everybody. Welcome back. It is now way nighttime, like nine o'clock at night. Um, I should have finished this video earlier, but I didn't. And then I had some family in town. My nephew is down. Um, with his daughter so yeah we were all just hanging out um i guess she would be like my niece as well right she would be my second generation niece or something like that Aaliyah. anyway it was very nice of him to come over and spent a couple hours with us so the girls all got to spend time together um they're all right around the same age and um Last time they seen each other was when we were on vacation up there, so... Yeah, alright, so let's go to the ticket. Uh, let's get it done. Here we go, get it done for fun. 10, 420 pounds, reefer core, clean, 124 pounds, sealed units, 310. Uh, radiator, aluminum, clean, 20 pounds. Yellow brass, 8 pounds. Irony all light, 78 pounds. Brass unclean, 24 pounds. Electric motors, 128 pounds. Clean aluminum, 26 pounds. Extrusion, 1 pound. Insulated copper wire, 110 pounds. Irony all heavy, 64 pounds. For a total of 1,313 pounds. 1313. For a total of $474.81. And then we went next door and we had number two copper. 37 pounds Re reefer ends 10 pounds high grade number one insulated copper uh 17 pounds and then bare bright 17 pounds total of 81 pounds for 219 dollars and 60 cents which brought our daily totals to 1,394 pounds for $694.41. And then that brought our weekly total up to about 1,900 pounds and about 1,300 pounds in weight. Boom. That was a week. Um, we've already started to set up for the yard sale. And we have some results. The results are in... The difference between the two trailers for the whole month was 678 pounds. 678 pounds. That was the difference between the two trailers. Crazy. Um, well, first, let me give you the monthly totals, build a little bit more anticipation. Uh, so just recycled this month, we had 41,000 pounds. 
41,702 pounds for $5,231.99. That was a really good month. And that's just all recycled. That's none of the sales that we had. That's none of the uh, anything. None of the washing machines or anything like that. All right, so here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. With the only 678 pound difference. Your champion for the month of March. Mighty Mouse came in with 20,512 pounds. Mighty Mouse came in 20,512 pounds. Scrabzilla weighed in 21,190 pounds. 21,190 pounds making Scrapzilla your first trailer champion of the month. Scrapzilla took it home. Took it home. Um, so at the end of the week, Mighty Mouse got three Fridays. Three Fridays in a row and Scrapzilla still pulled it out at the end. Um... And you know where it probably came down to was Wednesday. Wednesday, we were going to bring Mighty Mouse to the yard. I mean, to um, um, C&D Tires. And then the yard was closed, so we couldn't dump Mighty Mouse. So we came back and got Scrapzilla. And that was like 1,500 pounds. If it would have went the other way, Mighty Mouse would have been the champ. So, Scrapzilla... Scrapzilla wins the first month. We're going to do this every month. Every month we're going to do this. So now the question is, are you jumping sides? Are people jumping teams or are you staying with your team? It was close. It was close all month. 678 pounds of difference. Crazy. I didn't think it would be that close, but it is. But it was. So that's pretty neat. <laughs> Oh, uh, that's funny. All right. Good enough. Let's get to your quote of the day. Quote of the day. Strong people aren't simply born. They are made by the storms they walk through. I mean, it just don't get more real than that, you know? Most of the most interesting people that you meet in the world you uh you hear their story and it was crazy <laughs> you know um so just know that anything that you're going through right now it's just building character for a different time you know um so i really try to look at things like that remember it's not a bad day it's a character building day how we get through it how we manage it and then how we go on from there so that's a whole thing. That's a whole week. The yard sale has already started setting up. I'm already out of room. It's a little crazy. I'm a little overwhelmed right now. We almost got the garage. No, I don't almost got the garage all filled out. It's not real. I would like to have the garage all filled out, but it's not. So tomorrow is going to be a very interesting day. We're going to wake up early and jump right on it and hit it hard. So. Oh, we've we refilmed a lot. Holy moly. All right. Well, we're going to get out of here. Y'all have a great day. Check us out on all of our social media. Check out all the scrappers that are out there. Um, we love you guys. Always remember, there is no us without you. Team lift is more than just physical. So if you can help somebody out, we greatly encourage you to do that sort of thing. I appreciate you guys. It was fun. First month done. Um, Scrapzilla is your champion. So, very interesting. We like the coin flips. Thank you, everybody who is involved in a coin flip this month. Um, I think that's something that we'll keep on doing. So, thank you so much. We appreciate you guys. I'm out of here. Have a good night. We'll check you out on Monday. Uh, it'll probably be just the whole yard sale episode, which is something. Should be interesting. So, we will see you then. Have a great night.